Alright, Let's do it. Oh my. Can I have my deck? Uh, yeah, yeah let's, let's... No, yeah. that one. The white one. Oh. That's uh, mine. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Thanks. Actually, no, we'll do it on a side file in case it... Yeah, yeah, good idea. Yeah, yeah, definitely. And he's off. You got a time on this one? Ooh, I got a time I just got this one. Right. Do a $10 donation from... Hang on a second. From John Hugh Popeye. Yeah, we Thank got a ten dollar donation. Thanks, John Hughes. Oh, you should mention bets for the uh, the flying battery tails. Nobody knows what that is, though. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> They'll just drop their jaws. They, when they yeah, see it. they will see it and they will drop their jaws. Totally. We're up to 2691 according to the chip in widget. Okay, awesome. Wow. And we have a couple for uh, about 300 extra from PayPal donations. So we're actually pretty close to 3,000. Yeah. Slicenberger says, tell Mike that he beat his Metro 2 personal record. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he means Metro 3, never mind. Uh, why aren't any first person shooters being screwed on this marathon? Because it's kind of it's a classic games marathon with a mostly a focus on uh, 8 bit and 16 bit consoles. Um, we'll open up the uh, our next marathon will possibly have first-person shooters, and I know that um, some of our European members are planning for a first-person shooter marathon. Uh, I think for the spring, so uh, look forward to that. And, and pure question, well, uh, there are some good classic first-person shooters, but they don't really fit in with the theme of this marathon, but there is always next year, right? I actually would like to see Goldeneye run. Goldeneye <laughs> <laughs> throws a race, right? Uh, Shadow Jackie says, Mike, SO1 zip. What's SO1? I'm gonna have a go. What's SO1? Sandobolus. Oh, Sandobolus. Well, he's got a long way to go before we get there, guys. Cool. I heard it so quick you can't see it. Yeah. Oh, look, yeah. it's knuckles. I, I can't reach him up there because I can't fly right there. I don't think we lost him. I, I love Hydra City so much. I just want to come down here. on this level, but I've drawn a complete mental blank, so I can't do it.
<laughs> now the reason I did that is because that thing will start you spinning around in there and you'll lose control. So if you get out of the water, you can maintain control and get another Okay, cool. Yeah, this... Out of all the Sonic games, this is by far uh, Mike McKenzie's best. That was my favorite. Yeah, just for the record, if anyone actually cares what Nate thinks. Yeah, very good. <laughs> Even he's not running any games, he Bad, but there's a decent number still wandering around. 